Hey, look, you let them hash this out. I, I need to talk yeah. to you. Oh, let me guess. I get to pick out the after-dinner mints, right? Christy, what did you mean before when you talked about a crystal ball? What, what, is that the fortune teller you and Cass saw, or what? Mary Frances, please, I could cut out my tongue. Christy, talk to me. It was nothing, really. Hey, guys. Hi, Ryan. Hi. Hi, you're gorgeous. Hi, how you doing? Good. How are you? I'm fine. Oh, I fa my family's just a little afflicted with uh, wedding fever, so I thought I'd come over here, get a break. Yeah, I bet you need one, too, hey, huh? Yeah. You came over oh. here? <laughs> I hate to tell you, but we're a little afflicted with that sort of thing, too. Yeah, well, I'm sure that yours isn't as, as complicated as ours when we have the press, the Secret Service, oh, the, the Nuptician. Nuptician? Mm -hmm. There's his British. Lord What's-It did die in Charles' gig. Well, that doesn't sound very promising, does it? I guess our optician is Lady Christie. <laughs> and friends. Well, I am sure that an optician or not, Grand Vicky will live happily ever after. You know, there's, there's a lot more to do around here. Sure. And what's more, our nuptials have absolutely no significance whatsoever for anybody but us. And your friends, of course. Yeah. Well, I certainly hope that I'm one of those. So what can I do? Back some bird seed or what? Ah, he is a friend. <laughs> okay, what role do you play as long as you don't do what you did the first time around? Yeah, really. A long, harrowing story. Uh, well, you're the one who kidnapped Don't say, don't say the word. Look, bad, bad luck. Since I was the one who was responsible for the first time being messed up, I will personally guarantee that this one will go off without a hitch. Oh, really? Hmm? Then maybe you should talk to Christy because she seems to have some other information. Oh, Mary Frances, please. I want to know what that fortune teller said, Christy. I feel so stupid for even opening my mouth about this. I forgot how seriously you take things like this. What fortune teller? You mean the kid who read your palm down by the docks there? I didn't hear her say anything. You mean when I went to get the car, she said something about Frankie and me? I mean, what could my palm have to do with your wedding? Maybe she picked up some nuptitional vibe. Now give me the straight story here, Christy. I'll decide whether or not I should worry. Well, okay. This this child, this this waif, really, just said that she saw an upcoming wedding and that there was a problem. <laughs> Happy now? Thank you. 